sleep more, eat less. I guess it makes sense. It sort of made me hungry and tired all at once. Yeah, I think I know when I get a good night's sleep, Michael, and I wake up and you feel refreshed, you don't, I don't, I don't, I don't need to eat. I like to eat, but it's not like a half cravings, you know? Well, it's good that you're not waking up in the middle of the night with cravings. And that's exactly right. Let's talk about the weather here for a little bit here. And I can tell you this, on a cool night like this, it's not that hard to fall asleep. We don't have any severe cold in the forecast. We do have some snow to talk about right now on live triple doppel radar brought to you by Falso service experts. You know, we've got a spray of snow showers across southern areas, Ithaca and Cortland, and we've got a more of a concentrated area of snow kind of changing from lake enhanced to lake effect snow up to the north right now across the Oswego County and right towards the Tug Hill. Now you can always get the latest uh, radar imagery, live triple doppel radar on your smartphone. You can track that as you go through the night and into tomorrow. How about the snowfall forecast here? Here's right now through 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. Syracuse area, almost nothing. The focus will be across Oswego County in the Tug Hill, Redfield, Williamstown, up towards Richland. We're looking at one to three inches here. South of that, maybe a trace to an inch. Now, let's fast forward 7 a.m. Thursday through 7 a.m. Friday, a split snow forecast as well. Tug Hill focus again and the hills to the south. You can see concentrations up on the tug, maybe upwards of six plus inches. Again, Syracuse, kind of another spectator just seeing the snow. The temperature's so warm on the ground, it's not really going to be sticking all that much. Wednesday, 43, looks like yesterday's weather. Thursday looks like today's weather. And then getting colder by Super Bowl Sunday, 17, back up in the 40s for much of next week, Wednesday and Thursday. Michael. Like it a lot. Thank you, Josh.